Welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time, then welcome. Today I am going to be showing you the results I got from using this spiral rod set. So, if this is what you came to see, then stay tuned. I got the idea to use this from Curly Chris on Instagram and um, I think she may have a YouTube video for this but I'll link her down in my description and I thought this would be a really good idea because um, I've tried doing this spiral curl with flexi rods and it always fails so having this as an alternative is such a blessing so right now I'm using the smallest diameter in my hair because my hair is still short but I bought a set off of Amazon for like $21 I think and it came with different sizes so this is what the package looks like it's from soft and style and it has like 108 pieces so it has different sizes um, well, three different sizes. The smallest diameter is what I have in my hair, and the medium diameter looks like this, and the large diameter looks like that. And they all come with like this, um, I guess you could say this um, thing to seal the ends so that your hair actually stays in place while it's drying, which is really good and comes in really handy and in this video I am using lots of body products so the first thing I used on my hair is the five-in-one leave-in condition or leave-in treatment from lots of body and I also use the shape me custard jelly and then I went ahead and used their um, Style Me Texturizing Setting Lotion. So, let's get into the video. So, my hair has been separated into uh, six sections. So, I'm just going to go through each section and do this. And when I get to the top I will show you how I get it done okay so I have the last section I take my setting lotion and I work it through my hair Then I use a comb and work the comb, making sure that I untangle and remove any knots. I put some more setting lotion on the ends of my hair because that's the roughest part of my hair. Okay, then I go ahead and twist the roots. Then I take my spiral rod and I hook it through my hair like this. And then I take the hair and I bring it around the spiral spaces like this. And as I go along, I comb through to make sure that I'm removing any knots that may form as I go through the process. Do that again.
So I make sure my hair gets through the grooves until it reaches the end of this strand. And then once I get to the end of this strand, there's this closure that comes with the package. I go ahead and I lock the hair in with it. And then I glide it towards the end. So it smooths the hair as it gets to the end and it locks the end in like this. And that's it. So, I am going to try to sleep with these, and I know it's not going to be a very great night sleeping with these, but we're going to try, and then I'll be back to show you how it looks. Okay, guys, we're back, and I believe this is completely dry. Y'all, this is so hard to sleep with, obviously, right? So, I wouldn't recommend sleeping with this like do it early in the morning and then take it out at night but i'm gonna go ahead and take those out and then we'll see what the results look like look this is so springy So this is how you take it out. So remember that hook that we put at the base of our head? You need to unhook it and then you go ahead and unravel like this. And let's do that again. You take out this hook from the base of your head. So you unhook and then you unravel in the opposite direction of the curl. Voila. Bam. Okay, so now that my hair is done, as in I'm done taking this out, I will be right back to like fluff it up and unravel it. Okay, so we're back. So let's do this. Okay guys, so let's talk about this. So I like my results. I have a little bit of fringe, you can see, especially on this side, but it's not bad. Thing is, when I did this or when I bought this, I was hoping for like a one curl kind of look. So I was looking for something that looks more like this. So in different parts of my hair, I got this, um, I got my hair to make the one curl. Whereas, like in the front portion, as you can see, or some places in the back, I just got the normal curl that I would get if I used a flex yard set. And that's not really what I was going for. So, I do have a few tips for you if you do want to get, if you did want to get a one curl looking like this. So, for the ones where I got the one curl um, look, I actually twisted the hair more while I went around the spiral. So tip number one, if you want to get like a one curl look, go ahead and twist the hair before you put it around the spiral. So twist the hair while you make your way along the spiral. Um, and that should give you the one curl. If you do want curls that look like this, then you just go ahead and get the hair around the spiral without twisting. And that should give you the results that look like this. Um, I find that putting more hair, the ones that had the bigger sections with more hair came out looking more like this. 
and then the smaller sections with less hair came out looking like this. So putting a little more hair in each section and then making your way along the spirals will give you a better one curl look. Um, and the third tip is do not sleep with this in your hair. Sis, like sleeping with this is horrible. It's worse than sleeping with a ruler set. It is the worst. So I did not enjoy sleeping with this. So I would advise that you do it like in the morning and then take it out by night and you should be good. Um, and that's pretty much all my tips for getting a perfect look with this if you want a one curl looking set. I am going to try this again because I do want to get that one curl look and that was the point of getting this in the first place. So I'm gonna try this again. But this video is over and thank you so much for watching guys. Bye. If you like this video and you want to see more like it, don't forget to like, comment, and what, sis, what? Subscribe. Bye.